morning, Yola. Welcome to the loony life. So, this morning, this is just an intro to another video because for some reason, either my memory card's playing up or my camera, but some of my footage from the other day, day film. So, I was painting my bathroom, some of that's filmed, some of it, eh? Um, and I had breakfast and I did dinner. The dinner's saved, the breakfast hasn't. I went on a lovely stroll to get some like nice autumn -y vibes to start like a little intro to the video. They ain't there anymore. I'm gutted because I got the best sunrise. I got up at like 6 o'clock to get that sunrise because I knew it was going to be a nice day. I thought about that sunrise will be beautiful. I got up, got dressed, got out. It was like a crisp, nice morning. The day film. So, or day save. So today I'm filming an intro to that video so you know what's going on rather than it just being so patchy. So yeah. Um, I, I've got a dinner. That's all that's saved, I believe. I don't think my breakfast did. So here I'm having my breakfast now. Just, just a few bits of fruit and I'm probably going to have some granola or summer. Just something easy today. Because um, I'm also going to put in this video what I'm doing today. So I'm going to visit my mum because I'm gonna, I am forgot to fix some like tranquilments to her lawnmower or something. I'm not very good at these things, but we'll see how we go. <laughs> um, actually, I say I'm not very good at them, but I'm all right when I put my mind to it. I'm quite, I am quite a DIYer. Um, so yeah, today's just going to be like a mixture of days, but with DIY at least. So it's like at least a theme <laughs> with a bit of food in, because me and Mum will probably go for a. A brunch which is like a middle breakfast between which is a tie between breakfast and lunch <laughs> so that's why I'm only having a little breakfast this morning because I'll have that breakfast as well and then I'll have a lunch and then I'll have my dinner so an update on things so if you follow me on Twitter and that and on Instagram you know that I've been swimming and um, going to the gym a lot it became like a massive hobby of mine for the last year really but the last three weeks I haven't been able to go to the gym just because I've not had the energy to um, like I've just been saving my energy for normal life things and obviously filming and doing things on my channel and stuff just making sure that I've got the energy for that because I was just feeling that drained with what was going on so yeah I'm going to try and go tonight though. Even if I just do bits because I've kind of missed it. I've still been going swimming though. I had Sunday off just because I couldn't go. But um, I've still like been keeping that up pretty much. It was just after swimming that wore me out so much that it was really difficult to go to the gym. Um, just because my energy levels just aren't being what they should be at all. But like, I think it also had a knock on effect because my appetite weren't as good during that time either. I was like, I was eating bits but then I would just be full like really quickly or just not, or just not really want to eat anymore. So, um, that was having like... A knock on effect with my energy because obviously if you don't eat enough you are going to have enough energy you're going to feel like sluggish and stuff so yeah but my appetite's picked up now uh, I'll see how these next couple of weeks go I suppose I love starting my day with fruit and ending my day with fruit my favourite fruit on an evening is like strawberries or kiwi Sometimes I'll have a mango as well. Mangoes are kind of my midday snack though. If I just feel a bit peckish, I'll have a mango. 
But like um, nectarines are my go-to morning fruit. I love a nectarine. I like the juicier fruits in the morning, just cause like they help rehydrate you from your sleep, and they're just refreshing. Anyway, you know what? I just realised I don't keep eye contact very much when I'm trying to talk. <laughs> I'm like drifting, my eyes are like drifting around from the camera quite a lot when I'm talking about something serious. I've got to try and practice not doing that, which is strange because my eyes rarely leave the lens unless I'm looking at this part, the viewfinder, when I do ASMR. I don't know. I got it stuck in my teeth. <laughs> right then, I am going to get ready now to go to my mum's. That's the intro, you know what's going on today. Let's go. Okay, the time is now. Sorry about the lighting, the sun is shining through the bathroom window. Let's see how long it takes me to mask. So I'm just gonna mask all around there. This is old masking tape, oh shit. I'm going to have a game with this. These are my old pyjamas, that's why I'm wearing them. It's a bit chilly today. I bought a few pair of new fluffy pyjamas the other day. Oh bloody hell. I hate it when it like... Hello Darwin. Just breaking off in little bits, right? We'll see if we can do If not, I ain't fucking that. I'm just gonna whack it up there. And if I get it on the walls and I'll wipe it off after. Might have to be one of them. Come on. I'll start here just cause I can reach. Perfect, has he? I hope I don't break my sink or break my neck for that matter. I did get a bit of paint on the ceiling there. I'm out of breath yesterday. Um, so, but I'm hoping, but I'm hoping it'll peel off with the masking tape, to be honest. <laughs> It normally does. If not, I can just sponge it off because it is water based. I did go swimming yesterday because I was doing this. But I'm going Tuesday because I'm going with my mate. I'm going to bake some brownies for a video. And to be honest, that video will probably be up before this one. So I'll have to link it. Oh, I'm going to check some shit down by. I have someone to talk to while I'm doing this. Oh, bloody loser. Right. Oh, I've got to move these. I don't want paint splatters all over me towels. got something in my head. I'm ready to Well, that's the second coat done. It didn't take me long at all. 
So yeah. All I've got to do now is get a finer brush and just do the corners. And then we're done. So that's really good. I don't have a brush though. I forgot to get one. So uh, there might be one in the garage. I'm going to have a look now. There it is, mother, with her apple tree. <laughs> Cox's apples, he's on. Um, apple tree. That one's fell off anyway. That's oh, nice sweet. Dish. Look at that. This is our mission today. We've got a strimmer and I've got to put the pieces together. Yes, because it's a bit fiddly. So, Mum's getting the instructions out. Using the instructions. Let's see how much I can make a mess of this. That's the instruction. Uh, the instructions with that spanner that's attached to that. Because the last one, all I had to do was just clip that on. Mm. I didn't have to bother with attaching anything. Oh, right. So, jot the light on, or can you see? Uh, I think I can see. So we've got got this. We've yeah. Got that. Where's this piece? What, the screw's in here? I'm gone. I think the screw's already in here and you screw them in somehow. Let's try it. I don't know where they're screwing to. Ah, right. Well, can't they just do anything? I hate it when they do this. You know, that metal thing there, whatever it is, that got to stay flat. I don't know. the other one and my fly mail was a piece of piece I just connected it I didn't need no screws it just connected I just snapped it on I think I got it have you got it oh brilliant okay that well when we stop stressing about it it worked so I'm hoping now it stays dry for uh, at least a couple of days and I'll go out and uh, it is there anything else I've got to do? You just put the wheels on the lawnmower. Two front. The back ones are mine, it's just the front. Because I do these now without putting the bloody... F I don't know why. That's easier to pack, nicked. I reckon. Oh, easier to pack. Oh, it could be the packaging. Now we're going with the bloody wheels now. Did it say on there? Did it say front or back wheels? Um. What? Oh, the bastard wires are tough. <laughs> the back, not the front. I thought it was the back. Okay. Right. Have I got to touch this and all? If you want to, well, I mean, if you want to do the wheels and we'll attach it, then all I've got to do is just put it all in the shed when I come home. I'm go for a break here. Well, you have to attach that one first, anyway. So oh. give me that first, and then I'll attach that first. Oh, you got to attach this first for the wheels. I don't so. Isn't in that one that old down, is it? Oh no, there's no. no. That's last bit to do right. Yeah. Right push down. No, down. You push down. Up a bit. That's it, just hold it there. <laughs> you won't latch on. Hang on, let me loosen that one. Put the wheels on now to keep that in place. Right, where is the wheel? No, I need the wheels. I think so. That's the attachment of all the wheels. Oh, yeah, you sent your wheels. So they're not inside. No, I've just looked. There's nothing in here. Oh, hang on. Ah, there you go. Right, next time I get some, I'm going to have some piss easy. <laughs> I don't have to keep messing with. 
these things pee me off. Right. Do you need the light on? No. Nah. Oh, you know, them uh, root crisps mm. that, I, that, that we took on the trip but, but never ate. Yeah. Oh nice. my God, they are lush. Are they? Deep oh, fried parsnips. Oh. They, oh. I had to buy me another two packets for the day while I was in Tesco. Oh, I might have to get me some then. So I never got to try you. Hang on, let me show them. My mum bought these from Tesco. We did buy them on a trip and I never got to try them. I'm going to try them now. Come on, so they're really good. I've a couple of packets. Mmm. I think they're better than crisps. Yeah. So if you want to try them, oh, they are good. Mmm. Different, like... Mum, I like them. I love the parsley flavour. Mmm. Have you tried the parsnip one? I don't like parsnip broccoli. Oh, don't you? Oh, I'm joking you. Mmm. No, it's not like them. Yeah. Mmm. I thought they better than crisps. Mmm. Got like a different taste, nice. Um, right, what did you I'd... say you couldn't get on? I've got the wheel on, but I don't know how to fix them all together. Surely they don't just stick like that, do they just stay on? That one's loose. I need a screw. Apparently not, I just told you to push them on. Oh. Maybe they'll lock on in a bit. We've done it. I've had to film on my phone now because my battery died through mid faff. Um, Oh, Mum's got some uh, trick bars. These are lush. Bars. Trick bars. Vegan. Absolutely delicious. From Tesco's three in a box, but I forgot how much they are. I think they're about 260 or something. For free? What? I think so. They are expensive. You can get them for two quid when they're on offer, I think. Um, anyway, here, the lawnmower. Yeah. yeah, we did the crisps. Lushishness, lushishness, lushishness. <laughs> There you go, and there's uh, the lawnmower all done. And we're now going to go for some breakfast, aren't we, Mother? Yes. Can't be sorry, it took us an hour. <laughs> <laughs> to figure out how to put stuff together. Yeah, but the wheels, that was the worst, that we couldn't get the wheels on. But it's all done now. It's um, a vegan kebab and I've put a bit of onion in there and I've got a bit of bread in the toaster and a bit of sweet corn as well. The lettuce is in there somewhere, it's just right at the bottom <laughs> and then we've got a bit left over so I'll just put that on the side. Add a bit of mayo now and eat that up. Well, I went out with my mum. Um, I did the lawnmower and other bits that she needed, and my battery died. Oh, yeah, I haven't much luck, I forgot a battery and all. So, oh, yeah, I had much luck with this video. <laughs> I'm back home now. We went for breakfast, I had beans on toast, but unfortunately I couldn't record it because I had no battery. So yes, not much luck on the technical front and this video is going to be all over the place. But never mind, never mind. Um, I've just got back, I don't know what time it is, I think it's like one o'clock. I'm probably going to have a salad in about half an hour. I bought a pack of salad, like just lettuce and like a mixture of salady bits um i'll probably just have a massive bowl of salad with um a little bit of sweet corn that i got left because the salad it's not like a mixture of lettuce and red cabbage and shit like that let me show you actually and um because i've already filmed a dinner from the other day 
Oh yeah, I've got that tonight for tea as well, so it's the same. It, it would be exactly what I've eaten today. But anyway, yeah, this is the um, mixed salad. I'll put some sweet corn and I've got some um, cherry tomatoes. I'll put that in there. Um, I'll get, I've got some nuts, so I'll put some cashew nuts in there. I'll do me some tofu to go in it and all. And that'll be my dinner because I had obviously beans on toast and it was quite thick bread and I got a bit of pineapple so I'll probably put some pineapple in the salad as well might do that now while I edit this load of crap these are the apples that my mum's grown I've got to cut it in case there's grubs in it you see sometimes they live in the core oh that's a nice tough apple <gasps> and it's perfect there's no grubs love that remember picking these apples as a kid so it's also very nostalgic because I haven't had one of these apples for a very long time off my mum's tree because they normally are full of grubs but we've got them at a good time this year I sometimes like to dip an apple in hummus as well it's really good if you've never tried it I get this hummus from Tesco because I like the hint of garlic and the lemon in it I'm a bit fussy with my hummus but that just gives it a bit more taste here's my bowl of salad and I'm going to put my um, tofu in there and I've got my celery sticks to dip into my hummus mm -hmm. can't wait you know what though, this week has just been crazy like the other day the other day, right, we're shopping I had my bank card in my pocket and my, bank and my zip they zip up like the car and the pockets they zip up right i walked from the cash point to the market and my card had gone missing nothing else just my bank card so i'm like i've, I've had to use my mom's card today and then not like, keep transferring her money <laughs> it's an absolute nightmare i need fucking petrol and i've got no card until it comes in the post Postman I'm on strike. Could it get any worse? <laughs> oh, sometimes I'm a pleb. I've got the most chaotic brain. It just... It never puts anything in good order. On certain occasions it can be like so regimented, like does things so well in order and everything and then other days everything's scrambled everywhere and I can't concentrate. It's so weird. So anyway... I hope you enjoyed all that chaotic mess and that's it for today's video. Stay loony. Bye bye.